today I decided to bake something. Another marmalade pie. And no, I mean, yes, that's the only thing I can bake, but that's not the only thing I eat. It's lunch time, I might prepare something for my lunch as well now that I'm in the kitchen waiting for my marmalade pie to settle down and I decided to make some spaghetti, something very simple. I know, I know, the oven was really dirty and I'm trying to get rid of these stains but these stains are not coming off. I need vinegar but I'm not bothered to go to the supermarket and get it. But landlord, if you're watching, just to let you know, I'm taking care of your house, I'm cleaning your house, I deserve to get the whole deposit. <laughs> I have to say, I've done a really good job. I'm proud of myself. I like it. It's beautiful. I'm going to my friend's house, aka neighbor, to give some of my marmalade pie. Funny story, I saw him on Facebook and I sent him a request since he was Italian and he lives in Nottingham. So I said, okay, let me send him a request and he texted me saying i saw you i know you and i said how where did you see me and he was like i saw you making a video with your friend <laughs> and that video was so embarrassing i'm going to roll the clip That was so embarrassing. I said to her, we are going to make this video and no one is going to recognize us. No one is going to see us ever again. I was so wrong.
there is this place called Biston Marina and it's so beautiful and I hope to see the sunset so that I can show you how this place is so beautiful. You might have seen it from my previous video where I show some boats. Today I want to show you the place in a different perspective. silence, the sound of the nature, that's all I need every single day. <laughs> she is dangerous or he because he looks protective towards his family like him i want to ask one of those people who live in the boat how it is like living in the boat and show you guys how it looks like inside i don't i don't think i have enough courage to ask look at these houses tiny houses in front of the reservoir amazing i don't have any words to describe this place wow So you said you live in it full time? Yeah, I have done since, um, when is it, June? Yeah. It June last year. If you were to put your hand here, you will feel my heater would work. Um, just a uh, sort of diesel heater from that vent. All right. And I have all my electrics in place up yeah. there. Um, I have a fan for when it's hot in the ceiling. I have all the, the plumbing that all works. Um, I have two hob, uh, two gas ring hobs yeah. that work um, that work fine. I have a bathroom with a shower. Oh, do you? Even the shower? It's quite a basic one. I just, I have this kind of, um, this water container that I fill up and then I have 
um, a, a shower with a motor on it that just pulls the water out and then it just vents out the back. What's your name, sorry? Anika. Sorry, say again. Anika. Anika? Yes. That's a great name. Thank you. Thank you. I'll email you then. Sorry. I'm going to email you. Yeah, do yeah. that. Sorry, okay. I'm, I'm extra deaf today. I don't no, know why. It, it might be my accent. Oh, it, it might be, but um, <laughs> I'm normally quite deaf, so... Uh, but, um, yeah, definitely email me and, and let me know how you get on. Thank you. And uh, if I can help, yeah, I'm happy to do that. All right. Okay, you only long. Bye. Day. Thanks a lot. Bye bye. Bye bye for now. I'm back home. I hope you enjoyed Bison Marina like I do. It's one of my favorite places here in Nottingham. People there live the alternative or hippie life, meaning that they live on boats and camper vans. I was walking back home and I saw this sink inside this camper van and I immediately thought someone must be living the van life and I didn't hesitate to ask questions but I hope next time I'll be able to see a houseboat and ask questions to someone who's living the boat life. That would be so interesting. Before going to sleep, I'm going to ask you a question. If you had the chance, where would you like to live around the world and why? Me? I don't know. I mean, I know, but I have many options. It's not just one place I would like to live. It's many places I would like to try to live. Your question for me is, where are you now? Where do you live now? I live in Nottingham and I made a video about me living in Leicester. Now, I don't know if I'll be staying in Nottingham in the city after graduating or be back to Leicester or live in a completely different place. I have no clue and the only way to find out is to keep watching, to keep following my journey. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you have any video ideas, leave them in the comment section below and as always, see you in the next video. Thank you.